Thank you so much for watching. Today's video is on Solomon Ashe's conformity study. My name is Brian Collin. Remember, the best way to study is to take practice tests. If you can't find good practice tests, make your own and learn while you do it, or check our growing list of test banks for one in your field of study. Sign up for free at learnmytest.com. You can also click on the link in the description to take a practice test that I made using the Learn My Test tool. Ash's study started by taking people into a room where they were video recorded. He would initially tell them that they are taking a visual perception test. He would ask them to identify whether line A, B, or C was closest in length to line X. Seems pretty easy, right? I'm sure you can tell in this example that line B is the correct answer. Ash needed proof that this task was easy in order to set up his real experiment. He gave study participants 12 similar items asking them to compare lines. Ash found that people got the correct answers by themselves about 99% of the time, so nearly all the time. He can now conclude that this is an easy task where the correct answer is usually obvious. The second leg of the experiment, Ash had actors or confederates sitting in a classroom with the actual study participant. However, the study participant had no idea that these were actual actors. He thought they were other participants in the study. And so they were all asked to judge the length of lines, similar to in the first leg of the study. The study actors were told by the experimenter to purposefully pick the wrong answer. So in the case of the previous item, the confederates or the actors would purposely pick the line C, even though the answer is obviously B. So now back to the classroom. You have three actors who are going to call their answers aloud and the actual participant who is waiting his turn to answer the question. It's the first actor's turn. She answers incorrectly line C as instructed by the experimenter. It's the second actor's turn and he also answers line C incorrectly as instructed. It's the third actor's turn, and she also answers line C as instructed. Meanwhile, as you can imagine, the participant is confused because he knows the correct answer, but everyone in the crowd is answering it wrong. Ash found that participants go against the group and get the correct answer about 8 out of 12 trials, which is a lot lower than answering 12 correct, which is what he generally found by yourself. Even more striking is that three and four people purposefully miss at least one answer to go along with the group. This shows that most people may do something they know is wrong in order to fit in or conform to the group. Ash found that when actors answer different incorrect answers, like in the past example, one answered A and the other answered C, or when you add two participants instead of one, the odds of conforming or purposefully answering the wrong answer to go along with the group decrease significantly. In fact, only 5% of subjects miss the trials when two participants were included in the same group. So when you have a buddy, it's a lot easier to resist conforming a wrong answer to go along with the group. Ash's study is an influential and important study in psychology because it shows that we will purposefully do things we know are wrong to conform to the group. We are less likely to conform when we know there's someone else in a group that shares our views or opinions. This explains why adolescents and adults can conform to peer pressure and do things they know might be wrong. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you liked it, please hit the like and subscribe button to stay up to date on our most recent content. Remember, the best way to study is to take practice tests. If you can't find good practice tests, make your own and learn while you do it, or check our growing list of test banks for one in your field of study. Sign up for free at learnmytest.com. You can also click on the link in the description to take a practice test that I made using the Learn My Test tool.